everyone, and thanks for checking into Weatherbug here on this first day of 2015. Hopefully 2014 was good to you. We certainly wish you the best in 2015, and we certainly appreciate you stopping by and making us a regular stop here at Weatherbug. I'm meteorologist Todd Nelson. As we take a look at our forecast here today from coast to coast, we're still dealing with that wintry mess in the southwest. It is going to be shifting into the lower Mississippi Valley over the coming days. Texas, Oklahoma, the central and southern plains, and kind of dealing with that wintry mess as well. And this uh, developing weekend storm could bring rain and thunder and uh, wintry mess to the Ohio Valley, the middle Mississippi Valley, and also some accumulating snow. Accumulating snow, though, still ongoing on this Thursday over the Four Corners region. You can still see some of that wintry precip over Texas, Oklahoma, and a shifting into Arkansas and Missouri there. But as this main wave shifts east, kind of watching that thunder potential down over the lower Mississippi, Mississippi Valley, but look what happens on Saturday. You can actually see some of that st uh, storm, uh, the wintry precip again into the middle Mississippi Valley, transitioning into some snow to the far north. So this is going to be a pretty waterlogged storm system again. Precipitation-wise, over a five-day period, what you're noticing here is that there are some uh, potential maximums of nearly three, three and a half inches with any of that convective precipitation that does develop and then eventually spreading into the northern New England states as we get into that late weekend, early next week time frame. So again, pretty uh, waterlogged storm system. Uh, as it moves through the midsection of the nation. And then what it'll do after that as it pushes by is take, tug down some additional cold air uh, into this weekend and early next week. Take a look at that big surge of Arctic air modifying a little bit into early next week. But temperatures here for the day today, as you can see, not quite as cold as it'll be, but 61 in New Orleans, 79 in Miami. And then tomorrow morning, we're looking at still some single digits to the far north.